Hey everyone, Dulcie here and you're watching Candy's Garden. If you want to check out how I created this piece of art, stay tuned. Alright, so of course for this project we are going to need one of these cactus pieces. Yeah, there are many to choose from. But after scouring through this cluster of cactus, I have chosen the right piece for this job. She is down there, y'all. I don't know if you can see her, but she is this one down here. So let me go ahead and collect her, and I will be back to share what I'm going to do with her. All right, so here are the tools and items that you'll need for this project yes of course gloves 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 how many times do i have to say it? gloves because as you can see it doesn't look like this cactus patty has thorns on it but if you do not wear gloves you will be regretting it because there is tiny little bitty thorns on this that will need tweezers to take out yes so gloves I use this blade right here, which is kind of like a razor blade, uh, to harvest this patty, and this is what she looks like. And of course, you're going to need a exacto knife or something pointy at the end, and a permanent marker. Now, as you can see, I've marked some on this patty, but not permanently. Okay, what I did was just get the lid, and draw what I wanted to draw but I am going to permanently mark what I want and you want to be neat about this because you can always grow the inner piece that you cut out um, you can always grow that as well so I will share that as well let me go ahead and mark what I want and then we can cut her out all right so as you can see I have marked what I want to cut out and now it's just a matter of cutting it out. As you can see, I have cut through the cactus and this is what she looks like on the underside where I cut her. And all we got to do is pop that piece out. You wanna be careful. Go ahead and slide that piece out. There you go. And this is what it looks like on the inside as well as the back looks nice y'all and then this piece like i said i'm going to use it to grow another cactus there you go all we got to do now is set this somewhere to callus over and i will share what's going to happen next so I'm going to share with you what I did for a friend. Um, as you can see, I cut out the star and she's growing back. The star is growing back because it's a cactus. It will grow back once it's cut from the mother patty. Yeah, I hope you liked uh, that little piece of art that I did for my friend but yeah I got the star to grow into another cactus so I've left them out to dry for two days and this is what they look like on both sides please excuse my dog and then here's the other one As you can see it's really calloused over even the bottom yeah, now we are going to put them into soil and I'll show you what that looks like. So this is what they look like in soil. Here's the side view. There you go. As well as this one. The side view. And there you go. I'm going to go ahead and give them some water and update y'all in about a month of what they look like. So a little over a month and this is what they look like as of today, the 7th of September, y'all. Look at that. New growth 
on each of the cactus patties. Still doing well. Still healthy. Otherwise, they wouldn't be growing. I will insert a picture of an update of the one that I've uh, done for my friend. Hers is growing nicely. And these actually make great gifts. And now y'all know how to do it. Well, I sure hope you all enjoyed this. If you did like this, please give it a thumbs up, share. And if you're not yet a supporter of mine, feel free to subscribe and start supporting me. I greatly appreciate it. And remember y'all, love God because he loves you. And y'all have a nice day now. Y'all here? Bye.